let's consider another point on the ivy curve of a solar panel this is open circuit voltage open circuit voltage before now we talked about maximum power points whereby we talked about that is point a the voltage at maximum power and the current at maximum power and you should always know that the voltage the voltage at maximum power because this solar panel is under a load the voltage at maximum power is always less than the open circuit voltage we are going to consider open circuit voltage we will take a look at the solar name plates so that you see whether the voltage at maximum power is less than the open circuit voltage we talked about maximum power that your maximum power is gotten when your solar panel is under a load so but in this case your open circuit voltage is the voltage that you will have when your solar panel is not connected to any load so it's certainly going to be higher than the voltage at maximum power because the, the, the voltage at maximum power depicts when your solar panel is under a load so the open circuit voltage is the voltage that is measured across the two terminals of a solar panel when the solar panel is not connected to any load you have to be able to differentiate between maximum power points and open circuit voltage of a solar panel this is point d if you look at this point we have we are having a voltage at maximum power to be 17 and we are having open circuit voltage uh, to be 21 volts remember we said that a 12 volt solar panel a 12 volt solar panel will always give you this range and this is what you might likely have to be the open circuit voltage of on the nameplates and voltage at maximum power on equally on the nameplate so the open circuit voltage of a solar panel is the voltage gotten across the two terminals the positive and the negative terminal of a solar panel when the solar panel is not connected to any load the maximum power was when the solar panel was connected to a load but in this case the solar panel is not connected to any load that is the potential difference across the two terminals of the solar panel when uh, the solar panel is not connected to any load i don't want to be too professional here because we have uh, some people that are not so rooted so i will try and make sure that the terminologies i'm using here uh, will cut across every field of human endeavor i try to make sure that i use simple uh, uh, words to put across my point so the potential difference across the two terminals 
of a solar panel. That is the positive and negative terminal of the solar panel. When it is not connected to any load, will certainly give you the open circuit voltage of the solar panel. And we talked about the current at maximum uh, power. Um, you have to equally know that the this is always less than the short circuit current. Current at maximum power is also equally less than short circuit current. If you look at this point, you are having current at maximum power to be 2.5 here. That means if you extend from this point to this point, you have your current at maximum power. If you extend from this point to this point, you have your, you have your voltage at maximum power. Your short circuit current will always be higher than the current at maximum power. So it is your open circuit voltage that will give you an impression of how original your solar panel is. That is what you have to do. You test, you test the positive probe, link it with your, uh, with your multimeter to the positive probe of the multimeter. Connect the, we will experiment this in the course of our training. Then you link the negative probe of the solar panel to the negative probe of your multimeter. And you have a voltage. That voltage is the open circuit voltage of that solar panel because it is not connected to any load. So it is very important to test any solar module you want to buy in the market to be sure of the value of the open circuit voltage. Most times, the desperate uh, uh, sellers might manipulate the solar nameplate. So if you are able to get to, to go to the market with your multimeter, you will be sure of what you have when you are buying your solar panel. So when you test the open circuit voltage, that voltage uh, you will have when you connect the positive probe of your solar panel with the negative probe will give you the open circuit voltage of the solar panel. So open circuit voltage of a solar panel is normally higher than the voltage at maximum power. Let's continue.